Well, good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning. It's a beautiful day today. Yes, it is. We've got uh, quite a bit done already. We're cooking, cooking, aren't we? We did a lot of work today, uh, and, working on yard work. Right, and we've done a few things on the bus uh, mm -hmm. uh, yesterday and today. So, mm -hmm. And we got a gift. <laughs> wow, <laughs> it's exciting. Yeah. It is. Yeah, this is from some wonderful friends of ours, Manny and Cheryl, and they sent us a lovelier mic for Jim to use when he's recording. I can hook it up to cameras that we have and to our smartphone so we can use it when we're recording and it's especially good if you're interviewing someone or if it's real windy or something so and this is yeah, super nice I'm pretty it excited is about so it so exciting i'm telling you yeah so here we go yeah it's got a couple extra fun? fittings so it plugs in and also and has the little wind mm -hmm. the little wind blocker this little thing and the tiny little lapel mic it is so cute yeah so cool yeah it's thank great. you so much thank you thank you thank you pueblo star journal june 4th 1921 vast section of pueblo is wiped out by the worst flood ever known in the city many lives probably lost hundreds of buildings washed away and property loss expected to reach more than five million dollars that's a lot in 1921. that was a lot that's in 1921. <laughs> now they have little boats which we didn't even know no. isn't that great stand still for a second let me get under there with you okay it's raining today yeah it's a good day to pick to come to the river walk it is because at least we have it by ourselves nobody here and it's cool yeah Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, that is fun. Down here we have a little waterfall. Now I need a GoPro for this, but I don't happen to have one, so we're just going to try to Block, block the rain off of the camera. Hopefully I can keep it off of there. It's just a cute little waterfall. Isn't this great? Love the sound of the water. Well, it's raining harder. Now this is a little gas-fired fire pit. How cool is that? Right out here on the side of the river? That's really cute. What do you think, baby? Well, there's lots of little restaurants here, and here's another waterfall. It just sounds so beautiful down here. Even though there's a little music competing with each other. And uh, here's, they got their little boats parked under the rain <laughs> break. That is beautiful down there. And then there's water on the other side of Waterfall also, baby. What is it, Maisie? What's going on, Maisie? Isn't that cute? And then right across, It's a beautiful sounding waterfall. Isn't that beautiful? I 
Okay, some things I've done to the bus this week. I'll show you one thing that, we're, that we did. I painted the underside of our generator and air conditioner door. And then I put on a, uh, a little cable, steel cable coated to hold this door open. So, wasn't a big project, but it's something that I wanted to do because the air conditioner man, um, he suggested that when we're going down the road, I have like a, a big vent back behind there. Uh, there'll be more than enough air when we're going down the road to operate this air conditioner. But when we're sitting still, he said uh, they do need a lot of air flow. So he suggested that we lift this up when we're uh, sitting still, especially if we're running our generator. So I'm going to honor that. And I've got that all fixed. And we painted the whole bottom side of the door so it kind of matches everything else. Well, we had a really good time at the river walk today. <laughs> we'll start over. <laughs> <laughs> well, we had a really good time at the river walk today. Uh, yes, it was lovely, even if it was raining and, and a bit chilly. And the weather was super, actually. Yeah. I loved it, even though it was a little wet. And I'm going to have to make better preparations for a, have a GoPro or something that doesn't mind, <laughs> doesn't mind the water. This camera does mind the water. So. Yeah, and the, and the next week is supposed to be hot weather. Ooh, next it, couple it of said weeks, 95, so, so it's really nice to be able to uh, spend a little time outside and we don't get much rain so it's nice to have some cool weather it right? is and there were some really nice uh, sculptures there there were oh they were so a pretty bunch. they so had beautiful. some uh, little sports figures kids yeah playing baseball and we've never been down there we've heard i've heard occasionally people say there is a river walk in pueblo but i've mm -hmm. never been down there and didn't know there were lots of restaurants of course today it was not busy at all maybe we saw five or six other people but it has to down be there. busy a lot or yeah. there wouldn't be that many restaurants all, all those restaurants and they were open stuff. today too yeah. so yeah so anyway it was really pretty there was one little island thing that had like wild mm -hmm. turkeys um Sculptures, not the real Sculptures, thing. Yeah. yeah it had uh, <laughs> uh, bronze or brass uh, turkeys and uh, there was a buffalo, uh, what else? Oh, jackrabbits? Jackrabbits, a bear. A bear mm -hmm. and some mountain goats, mountain, mountain sheep. Mountain sheep, yeah. yeah. So it was kind of a fun thing, and uh, we have gotten a lot done around here this week, so that's encouraging. Yes, we took today as a rest day because we've spent the last two days working so hard outside, doing yard work. and That's true. Um, yeah using rakes and we pulling weeds and all <laughs> kinds of things stuff. we're not used to no we're not used to doing that much and so i have to tell you this a snake story okay snake story so i uh, probably a month or so ago yeah maybe more than that i was out there doing some work and i walked getting ready to walk up to one of the doors at the house and there was this snake coiled up there and kind of red Real, I've never seen one like it real before. Red. Real red. And it took off, of course, when I got up there. I have most of my life been very, very afraid of snakes. So I uh, move faster than the snake does usually when I see a snake. No matter what kind they are, whether they're poisonous or not, that doesn't really make a difference. So um, I told Jim about it, and he was like, ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. and I said, it was a really long snake. <laughs> <laughs> and he didn't believe me. So James, yes, I did. Yes, I did. Well, kind of, yeah. But yeah, he's like, yeah, she probably thought it was really long. Yeah. So anyway, James and Scarlett were here a couple, you know, like last week sometime, and they said we saw a long red snake crossing the road not far from here. So um, that was a little bit of proof. You know, that substantiated my story. story. No, it's almost <laughs> over. Almost <laughs> over. So yesterday, Jim came to me and said, Hey, guess what? I, I caught your two snakes. Two snakes. Two of the red ones. They were um, in this little area where he had caught some snakes before they get tangled up in the wire and stuff, I guess. Mm -hmm. And Bird netting. so he said there was one that was 
six feet long or so. Yeah, the male. The one about five. The female. And then the other one was about five feet long. And it was the male and it was bright red. So and there you go. They're actually, they were um, coach whips or red racers, red racers is what yeah. they are. They're non-poisonous. And they do sometimes eat rattlesnakes. They love which to is eat good. rattlesnakes and mm -hmm. mice and crickets and bugs. And yeah. They're good snakes. And they're the kind well, I like to have around. I'm not sure there is a good snake. Yeah. <laughs> However, I just want to say this for you you out there that um, if you if you send me an email or a Facebook or something that says this is the way you tell if they're poisonous, you look at the pupils of their eyes or you look on underneath their tail. <laughs> That's not going to happen because if I see a snake, I'm out of there. Yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. That's true. So, yeah. hey, thanks for watching. <laughs> and uh, Sorry for the long story. <laughs> it's okay, baby. <laughs> thanks for watching. And we just want you to know that you are important to us. And we do appreciate you watching. Mm -hmm. And we're having fun. Life is a joy. Yes. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs>